All right, so let's bring up Tom Travis to give you guys an update on uh, Puna Geothermal Venture. I would like to tell you where we stand. Um, today, access was closed to PGB, so the work we've done is uh, what probably is going to stand. Uh, when I came here, lava was present on PGB, so this is what has been done. When uh, Mayor Kim set up the task force, or the governor set up the task force and put Mayor Kim uh, in charge, we had the five goals there on the right. The first was to remove hazardous material, primarily pentane. Uh, that goal was done. The second was to process clear, and I haven't talked about this one very much gets into technical things that the people at Puna Geothermal Venture have to do. But when they shut off their plant, the pipes continue to be full of hydrogen sulfide. And even though they removed the pentane from the plant, some of the plant has had residue pentane in it. If the lava were to come into that field, then that residue would have been released to the community. So uh, put a geothermal venture at that point did what's called process clearing using nitrogen to push out the noxious gases and using vacuum from the uh, reserve to suck out the hydrogen sulfide to ensure that they will not be a problem as the lava moves across the field. We had, I have said many times that I didn't know what capping a well was. Uh, Mike Calacchini finally told me what it was. It's closing the upper uh, master valves. So using Mike's definition, our goal was to cap all of the wells. That was done when PGV shut in on March 3rd. The next goal was to quench all of the wells. May 3rd, excuse me, thank you. The next goal was to quench all the wells. And the last goal was to plug the wells. Finally, we wanted to reduce the profile on the wells. Next slide, please. The wells on the left are production wells. They go into the hottest portions of the geothermal resource. And that's where steam and brine come up from the resource. The ones in gray are injection wells. That's where cold water is returned to the resource, usually in a place that's much cooler than the hot part. The production wells are the ones that were of most concern. You can see across the top the status of those production wells. The ones in gray are the injection wells, and you can see the status of the injection wells. Mayor Kim told me to quit being so complicated and technical, so if you have questions about any of this, I will be available when it's over, and I look forward to talking, speaking with you. Thank you.